And the lack of clean water is one reason several Austin City Council members are calling on the city manager to launch citywide food distribution sites in the aftermath of this crisis. KVU has reached out to the city manager's office, but we haven't heard back just yet. Joining us live right now is Mayor Pro Tem Natasha Harper Madison. She signed a letter to Spencer Cronk along with council members Vanessa Fuentes, Pio Renteria, and Greg Casar. Thank you for joining us today, Council. Thank you for having me. Mayor Pro Tem, first of all, let's talk about the need we're seeing here in the community. What are you hearing from your constituents? What do they need from the city right now? Uh, I think everybody knows, you know, that the primary need right now is food and water, the things that people need to sustain life. Um, and that's a lot of what we saw today here at the Millennium Youth Entertainment Complex uh, at 1156 Hargrave. Uh, folks needed food, they needed water, and then some of the other items, you know, had to do with personal stuff. So diapers and wipes and feminine hygiene products and incontinence products for adults. And Mayor Pro Tem, what was the city manager's response to that letter, if you've heard from him yet? I have not heard a response yet. I look forward to it. If the city manager does get the ball rolling on that, what would you want those food distribution events to look like from the city? Would it be hot meals, packages of groceries, or a combination of the two? All of the above, absolutely. It would be great for folks to get everything that they need, and that would include both, um, you know, so, sort of heat and eat, ready to go food, but then people are gonna to need to be able to sustain themselves for you know several days to come. Mayor Pro Tem, thank you for your time today. Thank, thank you, you. I appreciate you all having me. Sure. Absolutely.